seven, eight, nine. <laughs> Hey guys, uh, I have a job for you. Are you interested in a little side work? Uh, yeah, I'm always interested in a bit of extra cash. Yeah, I guess so. What's the job? It's a gardening project, planting lettuce in a greenhouse for four months. Four months? It doesn't sound like a side job. Well, it's only a day a week, so it's really only four days a month. But what does it pay? Mm. Well, this is the kind of job that you get better at every day, so I'll give you a raise each time you work. What's the catch? The catch is that you can earn either a penny or a dollar on your first day. Uh, that's easy. I'll take the dollar. But there's more to it. If you take the dollar, I'll give you a dollar raise each day. And if you take the penny, I'll double your pay each day you work. Uh, well, for me, that's still easy. I'll take the dollar because on the last day, I get $16. How hard can it be? Mm-mm. Hold on, Tony. Don't be so sure. If we take the penny, our pay will follow an exponential growth model. If we take the dollar, it'll only be linear. Well, I know exponential growth sounds great, but, you know, how fast can a penny really grow? I think I can show you. Let's lay this out. <laughs> okay, Tony, you're taking the dollar for the first day. Yep. So we'll put a dollar on day one, then two on day two, three on day three, and so on. One. one. <laughs> I made $16 on the last day, and in total, I made $136. Not bad. Great. I'll be taking the penny for the first day, and we'll run the experiment again. So I made $327.68 on the last day. I averaged over $40 a day. That's not so bad. Wait a second, are, are you sure you did that right? I mean, I only made $136 and that's $8.50 a day average. I can't believe it. It's the power of exponential growth. All right, you know what? I'm starting to get this, especially if you're doubling. That's some pretty fast growth. But what if you're not doubling? What if you're just using a small percentage increase each time? You can have a model for that too. Think about this. Two towns start off with a small population. Littleton has 1,000 people and Tinyville has 500 people. Let's say Littleton grows by 50 people each year and Tinyville grows by just 5% each year. So I wonder how long it'll take for Tinyville to reach Littleton's size. Ah, I have a chart to show you that growth model. Come on over here. See, you can see right here that the two curves intersect. And after that, Tinyville gets bigger a lot faster than Littleton. Whew. Well, I'm convinced. If just 5% exponential growth beats linear growth, well, it really does show how powerful this model is. So, what do you say? You interested in taking the job? Well, I don't know. I mean, it sounds like a lot of work. Can you let us think about it? <laughs> well, I'm in, but that's just my two cents worth. Oh! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs>